This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this Friday, the to the fourth of August. You just lost it completely. They up the fourth of August. And we're looking at the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Down to up 131, held the 14 period moving average, a little doji candle yesterday, bouncing off that. Uh, the nine period moving average is still not even close to turning negative. We're also looking at the MACD down uh, negative, the stochastic flat at 76%. That's good. So all of this says that this is a ro rolling over, slow rollover. That's what we're looking at. And I'll discuss it in detail in my show coming up, Tiger Technicians Hour. What we're looking at in terms of the S&P, it's given back most of the gains from earlier this morning. It hit 45.30, now it's trading at 45.14, up 13, still up very nicely. Uh, watching this closely, it did make a peak F top just like the Dow uh, on the daily chart. This was at 45.07.07 um, about a week and a half ago. So we're watching to see if it keeps going down. The QQQ, the NDX 100, um, trying to rally. It's now up 46 cents, but it actually hit 377.47. Now it's three points lower than that. It had a high of 387.48. This is the dreaded H pattern. We'll talk about that when I get back from my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour. IWM Russell 2000 now negative. It was trying to rally before. It's at 194.32. Gold, gold had a sharp pullback, then a sharp move up. Now it's up nine. Uh, got stalled at the 200 period exponential moving average. I mean, that's how important these things are. Looking at the dollar, dollar tried to rally, it failed. Now it's down sharply, down 59 ticks at 101.88 in a potential peak D. These peak Ds, the fourth highest peak in the Chapman wave, whew, got to be careful of those. Looking at the crude oil, crude oil is uh, coming back a little bit. It's up nine cents at 81.65. It's made a peak D and stalling right at resistance, and we'll go to the TLT. TLT tried to rally earlier on, and then it pulled back. Now it's up 77 cents at 95.62. This is not a very pretty pattern uh, in the bonds. The bonds look like they yields are going to go a little higher, uh, but they're getting close to the area that says, watch closely. I'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. See you in a moment. Thank you.